Populaires were leaders in the late Roman Republic who relied on the people's assemblies and tribunate to acquire political power. They are regarded in modern scholarship as in opposition to the Optimates, who are identified with the conservative interests of a senatorial elite. The Populaires themselves, however, were also of senatorial rank and might be patricians, noble plebeians or equites. Populaires addressed the problems of the urban plebs, particularly subsidizing a grain dole. They also garnered political support by attempts to expand citizenship to communities outside Rome and Italy. Popularist politics reached a peak under the dictatorship of Julius Caesar, who had relied on the support of the people in his rise to power. After the creation of the Second Triumvirate, popular eyes ceased to be a relevant political label. Besides Caesar, notable populaires included the Gracchi brothers, Marius, Cinna, Setorius, Saturninus, Sulpicius Rufus, Drusus, Claudius Pulcher. Rallis and Crassus and Pompey. Both Pompey and Crassus had, however, fought on the side of Sulla during the Civil War, and after the death of Crassus, Pompey eventually reverted to his position as a conservative optimus. These shifting allegiances are reminders that the designation populaires refers as much to political tactics as to any perceived policy. Indeed, Republican politicians had always been more divided on issues of style than of policy. Prominent members Tiberius Gracchus, Gaius Gracchus, Gaius Marius, Lucius Apuleius Saturninus, Quintus Setorius, Marcus Aemilius Lepidus, Marcus Licinius Crassus, Catiline, Julius Caesar, Publius Claudius Pulcher, Mark Antony, Ideology, a historian of the late Republic cautions against understanding the terms populaires and optimates as formally organized factions with an ideological basis. This summarizes the dominant interpretation of the populaires in 20th century scholarship deriving in large part from Ronald Syme in the Anglophone literature. In the early 21st century, and as early as the publication of the ninth volume of the Cambridge Ancient History in 1994, the validity of examining popularist ideology in the context of Roman political philosophy has been reasserted. T.P. Wiseman, in particular, has rehabilitated the use of the word party to describe the political opposition between optimates and popularists, based on Latin usage and pointing to the consistency of a sort of party platform based on the food supply and general welfare of the populace making land available to those outside the senatorial elite, and debt relief, 